there are five things that you must master in order for you to be able to get into med school. A lot of students get stuck at thinking about the GPA and the MCAT scores, which are really important and that's a given, but there are five other things that you must master in order for you to get into med school. I'm gonna tell you exactly what they are, but first, my name is Dr. Beruz Momeni. I'm the CEO and founder here at BMO, where we help students with applications to highly competitive graduate and professional programs. Now, I have a good news for you. If you're applying to med school, we're actually giving away copies of our ultimate guide to med school admissions book absolutely free. So you can grab a copy by going to bemobook.com. That's B-E-M-O book.com right now. And you'll be able to grab a free electronic copy of this book. So going back to those five different things that you must master aside from GPI and MCAT, what are they? Let's think about this. So here they are. First of all, you need to learn to strategically apply to very specific list of schools rather than applying to every single school there is within your geographical reach or within your interest. This is really important because if you apply to inappropriate schools, of course you're not gonna get in. So you need to learn how to strategically select schools that make sense based on your own unique experiences and of course your own GPA, MCAT scores and other experiences that you have. Second thing that you need to master is you need to be able to select individuals who are gonna write you outstanding letters of recommendation. So your referees can just be anyone. They, you have to be able to, again, strategically uh, select uh, individuals who are gonna write really good letters of recommendations and something that admission officers are looking for. Number three is you have to learn how to write really compelling personal statements, medical school essays, and also lists of past activities. Basically, any sort of written application document you're sending is also a test of your communication skills. And because they get a lot of uh, applicants each year, sometimes, you know, in the tens of thousands, yours has to be really, really fantastic. There is no way around it. Now, once you've taken care of your applications, of course, you also have to do really well on your CASPER test. In fact, if you don't do well on your CASPER test, depending on what school you're applying to, you're probably not even gonna get to the interview stage. And the fifth uh, sort of a thing that you must master is interview skills. And they take a long time to develop, similar to uh, skills for the CASPER test, because both of those are functional tests or behavioral type tests. And modifying behavior takes a lot of time compared to something such as a memorization test, let's say your organic chemistry test. So you have to uh, strategically plan for all these five stages of your application process and make sure you know everything there is to know before you actually get to each stage. That's a common mistake a lot of students make. They wait way too late, uh, way too long before they start, for example, preparing for the CASPER test or their interviews or even their application documents. You need to know everything there is to know now so that you could strategically plan in advance and start getting ready right away. So as I mentioned, the good news is that we're giving away free copies of our Ultimate Guide to Med School Admissions book, which has got strategies about everything I talked about, all those five different things that you must master. And you can get, grab a copy by going to bemobook.com. This is going to include uh, information about how to make your application standouts, how to write excellent uh, medical school personal statements or essays or list of activities. It tells you how to choose uh, specific schools where you have a great chance of getting in. It includes strategies for choosing your referees. Of course, it includes strategies for preparing for the CASPER test, including sample questions and answers. It also includes uh, a lot of information and proven strategies about preparing for your interviews, again, including sample questions and answers. There's also six case studies of past successful applicants and you get to learn from their uh, sort of uh, strategies and also the mistakes they made which is going to really help you out there's a lot more information in this book and i'm sure you're going to love it so all you have to do is go to bemobook.com and you'll be able to grab a free copy for yourself all you have to do is pay a very small processing fee and we'll send you the electronic version absolutely free and if you were to pick up the copy on Amazon, it's gonna be around 20 bucks, but from us, all you have to do is pay a $5 processing fee. We'll send you the electronic version absolutely free. 
Also, if you haven't written your MCAT, as a bonus, we're gonna include a free copy of our 10 sample difficult MCAT CARS passages, including our expert analysis and response. You're gonna get that as a bonus absolutely free as well. So go to bmobook.com, grab yours right now, and I'll talk to you soon.